Alright, um, against the mage. Suggestions for replacing Waxred and Tess. Waxred is not a core card of the deck at all, though I would probably not be playing Candle Breath if it weren't for Waxred, so you might want to cut that as well. I would not I would probably not play this deck without Tess, to be honest. I think Tess is like a really core part of it. I suppose you could play it without it, but it's like, you know, a really uh Whoa! Amazing. A really sort of central part of what's going on. How much is this worth to you? Getcha. Ah, my back is like just pretty sore. I uh I pulled something yesterday. Squatting. Alright. Boom. I'll take that. You've... Okay, so this deck must be like a hybrid west slash elemental deck. Just attacking my face. Okay, I could just sky captain this. I could also just Zephyrus for a hungry crab. I'm just gonna hungry crab you. Like that's a huge board swing. I don't think I'm going to shadow the Zephyrus yet. I'm going to keep, keep the pressure on with it. Okay. We have lots of things that we can shadow step in our deck that are all very good. And I just want to force my opponent to deal with the board state. Sky Barge Amalgam. Boom. Flame Ward. Yep. Oh, Elise Shadow Step is so busted. We just go off forever. I'm just playing this. It's not two times. You literally Elise, then you Shadow Step the Elise, then you can keep, you get another Shadow Step. You can keep, you literally just can keep Elising. It looks like this is a Highlander deck. Parrot is a beast, yeah. <gasps> oh my god. We also Elise, and it copies our Sky Barge and advances our quest. Hmm. I don't really care too much about the, the Tess effect here. I actually kind of want to just use this so I can just play it now and trade this with these. We need to actually be able to copy. We're actually not. Yeah, we're if we play if we play Elise next turn, we copy everything here. We don't copy the right hand card. Uh huh. Sure. I have nothing to play afterwards though. I guess I'll just. I'm, I'm just gonna Zilliax this. All right. So now we actually have the infinite, infinite Elise. Okay. Oh, I guess I should use this one. You're right. Yeah, I should I should use the right hand the right hand uh, uh, shadow step for the Elise to make it more likely that I can keep uh, copying the Elise. Sure. Well, in Sky Barge, Sky Barge Amalgam. Elise does not copy the hand randomly, it copies it from left to right. Okay, I get Conjure's Calling. Corruptor, okay.
Um, how many cards do I have? I have eight cards right now. Eh, I'm just gonna Alex Straza. I think like a Malagos so I can bend into this. Oh! Yeah, I should have. I, there was again. I should have played the right side, of Alexstrasza. I was literally just talking about it. This one I knew was going to give me zero truzo, so that's why I played it that one. Your feeble magic I may, I may have to like stop memeing so I don't die. Well, if you attack my face, I get another six six. Are you just doesn't this just kill you? Are you literally dead on board now? You are. Why'd you just go and kill yourself? Need a hand <laughs> I just have to go off infinitely, you know? Ruined. Oh well. Is mine. Like, attacking face literally left my opponent dead on board. I'm so sad. I wanted to just keep going off with Elise. I mean, to be fair, my opponent has to, like, kill me in order, you know, because I'm just going to, like, literally have infinite value. But that's not the way to do it. 